Hey guys, Jimmy Chicky here, Keller Williams. Listen, today we want to talk about action plans. So this is over here on action plans. We're looking at Keller Williams command. This is agent.kw.com. Um, it's going to switch it to this link in case that gets confusing to you. But basically, you want to remember agent.kw.com, and we're going to look at it in Chrome. This is Chrome, and I'm in incognito mode. So let's figure out how to do a smart plan. Okay, so I'm going to click on the smart plan button. And then I'm going to, whenever you create something on command, there's always a button over here in the upper right hand corner. Okay, so we're going to create a new plan. All right, and I'm just going to call this the test plan. All right, um, I'm actually, oh, I already have one with that name on it. How about the test to plan? There you go. Um, okay. And you're going to say, well, what's our action plan? And in this case, I'm using Nick Baldwin's Facebook um, action plan. All right. And I, I'll post this uh, on the YouTube link if you need it. But uh, basically, step one is to, on day one, to send uh, a text, SMS or MMS. So I am just going to copy this. We're going to go back to the window. What's the first task? send SMS. So let's click on it. Okay. Um, it's showing you here that my Twilio account is connected. That means this text will go off automatically. I'm going to click there and I'm going to click paste. Now, the one thing we want to be a little bit aware of is that these links right here will automatically put in the contact's first name. All right. But since I just cut, copied and paste, I actually have to attach it. So I'm going to say contact first name. Now, do you see how it's a little different, you guys? So I can actually erase this, all right? So this is showing me that it is indeed connected, all right? So that's, that's what I'm looking for, all right? I wanna see that name right there, all right? So let's do the next one, agent's first name. Now, in this case, it's just me. So I could say this is Jimmy, all right, with Keller Williams. You, I might have, um, I realize you might be ready to make a move just yet and is contact email. Remember when we're doing Facebook ads that the information is automatically placed in there, but we're just putting this in here to confirm. All right, so that's it. I'm going to hit the save button and now we have step one of the, uh, of the action plan. So let's go back to my Word document. Okay, what do we do? Set delay at one day. All right, so let's go back here. Delay, there it is, set delay. We're gonna click on it. Look at that, the default is one day. All right, and we're gonna do one more step just to keep it interesting. And on this one, um, send a subject, thank you. All right, so let's just copy all of this. Doom, copy, and then we're gonna come back here. And we're gonna say email, there it is, send email, okay? And then it's automatically gonna send it to the email that you've set up inside command email. So I'm just gonna click paste. And remember, just like before, we have to go in there and add in the goodies. So let's put their first name, contact first name, hi Joe or whoever it was. And then I'm just gonna put my signature in here, Jimmy Chicky, Keller Williams, Realty Southwest. All right. Please complete all the forms. Oh, I forgot a subject. Um, what is the subject on that one? Let's see what they wrote. Let's go there, sorry. Um, thank you, all right. So we'll type in, thank you. And we'll hit the save mark. And now we finish step two. We're gonna continue this all the way to the end. And then you, you have to decide at the end, what do you want to have happen at that point? You could restart the flow. So that means it would send all of this all the way to the end. And then if I just click this bottom at the, this at the bottom, Whoops, new action. There it is, restart flow. Okay, how many times? We'll just say one, all right? Um, and that's one way just to keep the action plan just going over and over. So that's just a basic gist, and then you click save. That's just a basic gist um, 
on action plans. Now look at the, the rules. Cannot restart an action plan is less than 15 days long because that would be kind of annoying that if you sent the same thing over and over and over and over. So it's going to make me make some changes on it. And uh, one way I can kind of cheat is just by making the wait 20 days. Ta-da! Boom. And let's save it. And there we go. Now we have our action plan saved. If I go back to um, my action plans, my smart plans rather, you can see there's my first 10. I'm going to click and at the very end there'd be test plan 2. If I want to add it to a contact, I can just add it to a contact right there. Or when I'm working in contacts, this plan will now show up. Okay, so that's it. Hope you found this helpful.